Let's take a look at finding the population coefficient of variation. First thing we'll do is we'll type our numbers in. So I got 2, 8, 11, 17, 25. Now if I review my formula, our coefficient of variation is equal to standard deviation divided by mean times 100. So I need to find a standard deviation and mean first and then uh, do this calculation. Okay, so mean and population standard deviation. And that's going to give us our coefficient of variation. So I come over here to the mean. I click my functions. Scroll down if necessary to go to statistical. And uh, it's under average. And I'm going to click over here in A1, drag down to A5. So it fills it in automatically for me. And then press enter. And now I'm going to do an equal, or not equals, because I don't want, I want to sh demonstrate using the functions instead of just typing in directly, because you probably don't know it, so you'd probably have to use your menus. So I go over statistical, I will go to standard deviation, now down here we got standard deviation A, standard deviation P, um, oops, standard deviation dot P, and standard deviation dot S. We want the population, so I want to choose standard deviation dot p. And I could uh, drag that or I could type it in. I could type in a1 colon a5 and press enter. So now our coefficient of variation is standard deviation divided by mean. So I do an equals and I'm going to type in d4 and it'll access uh, the population standard deviation divided by d3 that will ask to access my mean and times 100. And then press enter. And that will give us our population uh, coefficient of variation.